What is up you guys, this is Violet Taylor here and welcome back to Let's Catch a Vibe. Now, I hope it was feeling great, feeling amazing, feeling vibey. As you guys can see, I'm back doing the item shop switch over. On time tonight, pretty cool, pretty cool. Uh, coming up to 15 seconds left on the clock, this is what we had on our Saturday night item shop switch over. Not bad, not bad. I mean, we didn't really get anything new for Saturday night, but it's pretty cool. But what we're going to get tonight for Sunday night in 3, 2, 1, let's go! Sunday night taking us into the start, Monday morning. Ooh, okay. This is new. This is new. So pretty much we have the alien abduction bundle that comes with six items. So let's jump straight in and let's see what we have. So starting us off, we have the human built skin. He's just here to observe. Oh, damn. Oh, it's thundering outside. Oh, I love thundering. Anyway, part of the hot alien summer set first introduced in chapter two, season seven. You guys will have seen all these items before. So pretty much human bill can have various different customization options. As you guys will have seen if you have uh, pretty much been here since last chapter, the end of last chapter. But yeah, it's got various different customization options. It says over 4,000. I would assume there's about 4,000. Anyway, moving us on to his bat bling, we have a weather balloon caused by light refracting through swamp gas. Again, really, really cool little uh, UFO bat bling. Moving us on to the second skin in this bundle, we have the legendary Leviathan. Call me Fishman. Now, we did have this skin in the item shop recently. Part of the Space Explorer set, part of the OG Season 3. Moving us on to his bat bling, we have legendary Fish Tank. Do not tap the glass. Do not tap on the glass, please. Anyway, oh damn, I pressed the wrong button. Anyway, moving us away from his bat bling. We have the Harvest and Tool Flying Slasher. Harvest the Truth. Believe. Part of the UFO set. And last but not least, to finish us off, we have the Zorgaton. Freed from the lab and out for justice. We have Zorgaton. So, pretty much he had an alternate introduced not that long ago. So we've got the default. And then we have the dark version. Looks pretty damn cool. I actually like the dark version better than the default, which is pretty cool. I love both of them though. But anyway, for 2,500 V-Bucks, you get three skins, a harvesting tool, and two back blings. Now, moving us on to the alien abduction bundle, because we're not finished yet. We start off with a glider. We have planetary probe, scanning the unknown. Part of the space, space explorer set. Moving us on to another harvesting tool, we have the globe axe. Think globally, not Sorry, think globally, acts locally. <laughs> I like that. Moving us on to the last two items, we have the Freezy Friends. As you guys know, this is a human Bill's Harvester tool. Go on, give your friends a lick. And I'm going to say this for the thousandth time. No, thank you. Anyway, moving us on to the last one, the least, we have an emote. Extraterrestrial, interplanetary groove. First introduced in OG Season 9. Really, really cool. So again, you can buy some of the items here if you only want certain items out of this bundle. But I like the fact that they've wrapped it all up in like its own little bundle. So you get literally, for the price of the Leviathan, which is 2000 on its own, uh, you're pretty much getting a really, really good deal, I would say. Anyway, this is 100% worth it. I will be doing an Is What Is Not Worth It bundle video on this after this item shop. So stay tuned for that. Moving us on to the return of the second half of the Featured Storm. We are the return of the Tender Defender. Protect your nuggets. You heard the chicken? Protect your nuggets. Part of the Foul Play set, first introduced in OG Season 6. Moving us on to his back bling, we have the Hatchback. Come out of your shell. I think it'd be cool if they put it in the like in game files, like, or updated this back bling. So, like, when you get hit, it will actually crack to the point where it'll, like... Un, I don't want to say unshell a little chicken, small little chicken. That would be dope. Anyway, moving us into the return of the happy, or sorry, flappy flyer glider. Keep it flappy. You know, like that way it breaks out. Anyway, really, really cool. Moving us into the last but not least, we have the scrambler harvester tool. Mix it up. 
I mean, again, who doesn't want to hit somebody with a whisk? I don't think you'll do that much damage, because from what I remember, whisks are quite flexible. But it's worth a try. Anyway, moving us on to the return of another skin that I like. We have the legendary Tempest. Now, you guys remember, this is the skin that Midas got the idea from, and pretty much copied his suit design for the um, Cyclo Midas skin. As you guys can see, it does resemble a lot. I think Midas had this um, suit in like a glass plate case, because I remember Midas looking at it. Anyway, I had to purchase it because it's an absolute badass looking skin, and I'm all about the storm skin. So, we have the legendary Tempest, consumed by the storm, back for revenge. Jeez. Part of the Raging Storm set. It might actually be Midas that got trapped. That's why he was trying to fight back the storm, because he didn't want to become this again. Um, could also be why we had the Shadow Midas as well, because he actually got consumed by the storm. Um, because don't forget, Fortnite deals with, like, multiverse versions and timelines. Anyway, really, really cool. Moving us on to the Bat Bling, we have the legendary Lightning Cloak. Crackling with furious energy. Again, really, really cool. Absolutely love this. Moving us on to the female skin, we have the Bolt. Fearless Storm Fighter, first introduced in the OG Season 9. I could I just say, we like those, baby! Two reasons. There's a storm going on outside, and she's got those storm cheeks. Chase. Anyway, moving us on to the um, glider now. We have the Storm Eye. Harness the Storm. Part of the Ranging Storm set. First introduced in the OG Season 9. Last two items now. We have the Storm Bolt Harvest and Tool. Strike Light Lightning. Really, really cool. Last but not least, we have the Turbulent Animated Wrap. And man, this is cool. Absolutely badass. Love that it covers most of the weapon. Um, again, I'm very biased because it's like purple and gold and it's like purple as well. Really, really cool. I mean, whew, if that don't look fire on a sniper. I didn't actually realise I actually own this entire set, which is pretty damn cool. Anyway, moving to the daily store, as you guys can see. Uh, we got some really, really cool skins in here. We got the return of the instinct skin. I feel like this skin comes back quite often. You know? Anyway, we have the victory comes naturally. Part of the counter-attack set, first introduced in the OG Season 6, looking absolutely badass. Moving us on to the Bat Bling, we have the Reaction Tank, Pressurized. Part of the counter-attack set, first introduced in the OG Season 6. I don't want to know what's pressurized in there, just keep it pressurized. Moving us on to the return of the Maximilian skin, the number one aviator on Fortnite. We have Pilot Your Way to Victory, part of the Aviation Age set, first introduced in the OG Season 6. Cool looking skin. Moving us on to his Bat Bling, we have the Para Provisions, packed at altitude. Again, really, really cool Bat Bling, suits the skin really, really well. Moving us on to the return of the emotes, and we have a Harvest and Tool. We have Job Well Done. That's that. First introduced in the OG Season 5. Pretty much what I do after every item shop video. <laughs> anyway, moving us on to the return of the bold stance. <clears throat> Stand your ground and break it down. Jeez, first introduced in Chapter 2, Season 2, baby! Anyway, last two items, we have the Forbearer Harvester Tour. Is this a bit of a um, sneak peek to us getting Viking skins coming back? We have the Forebearer, wielded by countless generations. Part of the Norse set, first introduced in the OG Season 5. This is a really, really cool harvesting tool to use with the Kratos skin that I actually might get because it's a new, it's a new way to use uh, Kratos. Anyway, last but not least, we have the Burpee. Set a new personal best. Really, really cool. Woo! Go in circles! Anyway, enough of me messing about. Moving us on to the rest of the item shop. At the bottom here, you guys know we have Bundles Return Galore. So, pretty much starting us off, we have the Phantasm Level Up Quest Pack. We have the return of the More Offers featuring the Galaxian Emote, the Pac Brain Emote, and the Pac Man Bundle. Definitely recommend grabbing these. I literally just grabbed this before the um, item shop switched over. Moving us on to, pardon me, moving us on to the return of Starfire, the DC superhero from the Teen Titans, or should I say DC heroine. Anyway, really, really cool skin. Moving us on to the return of the Rainbow Royale free items. 100% recommend grabbing these because even if you don't like rainbows, they are free. Anyway, moving us on to the return of Patrick Mahomes, the gladiator. As you guys can see, I did tell you last night that the um, 
Destiny X2, the Fortnite X Destiny 2 collaboration was coming to an end and they have now left the store, but we still have Patrick Mahomes for those of you that love Patrick Mahomes. Now, moving us to the bottom half, we still have these special offers and bundles. But guys, really, really cool bundle in the item shop, the Alien Abduction Bundle. I don't know how long this is going to be here for, pretty much judging on a bundle. It's going to be here for like the next three days, I would at least assume. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did like the video, don't forget to smash the like button. If you did enjoy the video, let me know in the comments down below why you didn't like the video. Also, let me know two things. One, do you like this bundle? And two, what is your favourite skin from this bundle? So, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you're new and join Team Let's Catch a Fire. Also, if you are new, please don't forget to switch on the bell notifications to get notified as soon as I upload. But more importantly, don't forget to stay the, the, the vibey and I'll catch you all in the summer. Peace. I meant to say I'll catch you all in space, but I came out wrong. <laughs> anyway, peace.